Hello Aquarius, welcome to your April 2022 general reading with myself, Thomas Anak. You're watching Thomas's tarot page. Please like, subscribe and share. And if you like my work, you can now buy me a coffee on buymeacoffee.com forward slash medium Thomas. That's buymeacoffee.com forward slash medium Thomas. Now, Aquarians, what we do here is we will loosely divide the um, the reading in sort of areas. Um, so we look at the overall energy for the month of April 2022 for the sign of Aquarius before we will then go into your emotional core, see what needs to heal, see what needs to go, or maybe the guides will talk about love. And then lastly, we will look at opportunities as they present themselves to you in the month of April 2022. And opportunities will be, these normally are for the most part anyway, about things that sustain you financially right so with no further ado let's just get the ship on the road here we go let's have a look what we got as the overall energy for your april 2022 for your sign which is aquarius the sign of the cup bearer the sign of the giver you have freedom and success now you know, say no more. Freedom and success, what's not to understand? What the guides are saying to you, though, <laughs> in... Uh, hey, Molly. What the, what the guides are saying to you in April is this. Only when you are free can success really come your way. And freedom literally is a big word that gets thrown around a lot. What they're saying to you, Aquarius, is because you are the giver, sometimes you give too much. Oftentimes you give, you give, you give, because it hinders you from looking at yourself. And it is time you stopped and changed that pattern. In April, because we're coming into full swing of um, spring, the universe wants you to go with it, follow the new energies that we're getting, you know, the higher energies that we're getting. Freedom in your case really means is to understand that unless you call the shots in your own world, you will always be a follower and it's not what you came here to be, right? You have success as the outgoing energy, but the look at the card of success, right? So you have the card of success, and while you have success, the depiction is a panther. And the panther, by default, is a leopard. Right? And so the leopard has unique dots. And yet, he hides inside the panther. So, while you want to be successful, while you crave at times to be successful, you're holding yourself back. This my dear Aquarians, Aquarians is a self-esteem issue. And it is something that is actually, it sounds a bit weird, a bit of an imprint that you have, that your sign has by default. You, you at least energetically speaking, you tend to doubt yourself rather quickly. And you also tend to assign blame to yourself, which is why you don't understand at times how powerful, how strong, how bloody awesome you actually are. You, my dear, are a bloody legend, right? But you also are legendary in holding back, right? You have success when you understand that at times you put the shackles on yourself, right? Freedom and success is yours for the taking in April of 2022, provided you understand that the more you follow, the more you follow a routine that doesn't fulfill you, the less you will succeed in being happy with your own life. That was the overall energy for the sign of Aquarius for the month of April 2022. Let's have a look at your emotional core. Here we go. Yeah. 
that's good. <laughs> wow, yeah, this is awesome. Cards are a bit sticky here. <laughs> so, you have happiness, pleasure, and protection. Again, a lot of that stuff is in a way self-explanatory. You have pleasure in the middle, though. You know, it is surrounded by happiness and protection. So we will talk about the pleasure part uh, a little more in depth, if that makes sense. Ultimately, what the guides are saying, with regards to your emotions, they're not talking to you this month, which is fucking awesome, about healing. They're talking this month, in April 2022, for you to give it your all, whatever you want to achieve with regards to love, whatever you want to really make your own, you have to make it your own by going for, for things. Because the depiction of happiness here are dolphins. Okay? And dolphins are among the wisest of all beings on this planet. And yet, if they ever, should they ever be in a tight spot, right? They could literally take on sharks. Now, just to clarify this, you know, the universe is not anti-sharks at all, right? Sharks are apex predators. If they don't eat the fish that eat the algae, none of us has any uh, uh, oxygen. So leave the bloody sharks alone. That being said, <laughs> sharks can be ferocious um, and dolphins could take them on if need be. What that therefore means is that you need to go for things that you really want to happen this very month. While it is very lovely to be courted, if that makes sense, because you are a hopeless romantic after all, <laughs> while it is really nice to be courted, in April you should do the courting. You should be the one that says, okay, enough of the small talk, let's get to it, right? In any shape or form, because you have pleasure as your main energy for the month of April, right? So, go out there, love and feel pleasure, which is also important because the pleasure as the, as the, the main energy for your emotional core is saying to you that only when you really connect pleasure with happiness will you actually um, enjoy it. What that means is that in the month of April 2022, you will not be super happy with flings. You will not be super happy with casual stuff, right? Even if this is or should this be your preferred way of experiencing pleasure, so if it is physical, if that makes sense, you will be much happier when there is true emotions involved, which is also totally Aquarian. Right? So please understand this. You make it happen, but you go in there with claiming, I want this to be pleasurable. Right? Because the outgoing energy is protection, which means whenever, whatever you're planning, whatever you're doing in any intimate relationship you're in, because that's ultimately what we're talking about here, um, there is the need, if that makes sense, for protection. And what the universe is saying to you, you cannot always protect yourself, if that makes sense, because unless you put the time in, you never know how something really ultimately um, turns out. Trust your intuition. You will not be with any idiots, right, if you use your intuition. So while you are a person that likes to feel protected also by the person that you choose to be with, um, it cannot be um, something that needs to be there, if that makes sense. Uh, so it's not something that you can force or something that you can, can say, well, you know, uh, unless I feel protected, I'm not going to do anything. Simply, in your case here, it doesn't work that way. Right? You choose wisely, right? You will choose people that by default, and this is, I think, the whole point here for you, the time has come, no matter how old you are and who you are and what gender you are, 
whatever whichever way you you um, identify yourself or identify yourself with um, ultimately this is all about saying this month I want to truly enjoy this which also means that this is a good month to overcome some of your deeper insecurities by just going like you know what whatever happens as long as I have fun it's going to be great and you heard that as long as I have fun singular this is not about you and your partner this is about how you feel in it right make sure that whoever is with you really fulfills you emotionally this is your big task so to speak for anything to do with love if that makes sense now that doesn't mean that it is all very difficult for you to achieve if that makes sense but um whenever you feel oh i was just used here right if that makes sense um it might not always be the truth that someone actually used you it may just be the case that you know you were incompatible if that makes sense so let go of all these preconceived notions about how things have to be make april about literally pleasure with regards to how you feel emotionally and it doesn't have to be physical at all even though the way they show it to me it feels physical right so enjoy it any way you want if that makes sense right but call the shots really really important finally let's have a look at opportunities as they present themselves to you in the month of april for the sign of aquarius you are watching thomas's tarot page with myself thomas Yannack. please 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 <laughs> like subscribe and share widely and if you like my work buy me a coffee on buymeacoffee.com forward slash medium thomas that's buymeacoffee.com forward slash medium thomas opportunities you have miracles and release there is a bit of conflict here in how to go about things miracles mean that oftentimes and you need to reflect on this so that you can see what the guides are actually saying here while a lot of the stuff that you don't even go for could actually happen to you right if you just understood how how uh, how awesome you are if that makes sense right so miracles with regards to opportunities do happen you have to nonetheless release whatever whatever system you have in place that tells you that's not gonna work and that's not gonna work and i just noticed <clears throat> that underneath the release and the miracle card is another card and look what it is it's the wisdom card so you do therefore know that at times when it comes to opportunities you know that you can boycott yourself by thinking low of yourself so aquarians all throughout the reading one sort of thing that sort of came through no matter what we talked about is there's a part of you that has that that doubts yourself now doubt closes doors do not make it part of your life that's another important message for aquarius for the month of april use your inner wisdom if you realize i'm an old soul and i'm bloody awesome right you will notice how things can change and things will change when you acknowledge that people who want to be with you have to deserve you first and since we're talking about opportunities no matter who employs you right they have to make sure you have to make sure in epic sense that they understand who they're hiring and what your worth is now if you're self-employed that goes even further because if you are trying to manifest clients you certainly will manifest them by thinking oh my god i'm gonna fail i'm gonna be shit that is not how you manifest so ultimately have a good look at yourself acknowledge everything that is awesome about yourself and disregard all the other feelings that you may have about you that don't highlight how awesome you are anyway aquarians thank you so much for watching that was your april 2022 general reading and i see you all next month